Hey, what's going on everybody? Paul Shimon here with Business Politics. Question of the day, is obsession healthy? Quick answer, absolutely. It's not only healthy, it's a necessary. It's a necessary for you to give that amount of passion and energy into your purpose. Because when the obstacles and the challenges hit your way, you will have to be obsessed to fight through them. Now, some people say, Paul, I think you're taking a little out of context. You don't have to be that extreme about something. I say you do. Because if you approach something casual, you'll probably get a casualty, right? But if you approach something extraordinary, you will get extraordinary. So obsession is not only healthy, because it gives you that necessary fire and fuel that you need to pursue your goal, pursue your dream, pursue your purpose. But it's necessary. It's healthy and necessary. So next time you question yourself, am I being obsessed about this? And you feel like it has a negative connotation attached to it because that's what society does. You know, just look back at yourself in the mirror and say, no, I'm good. I'm heading in the right direction. I don't know of an, a great person in history who've exceeded at something in a high, high level without being obsessed. Now, you don't have to do something that changes the world, but the way you approach your purpose, that's so important. Why not give it all in? You know, we use words like persistence. We use words like commitment. We say things like, um, hey man, I'm dedicated. All those are just forms of obsession. So make sure that you are. You know, when we say we're disciplined, what are we really saying? I'm saying no to the distractions and I'm saying yes to the priorities. What does that mean? It means I am obsessed with focusing on the good of where I'm going, what I'm pursuing. So don't question yourself. Get obsessed and don't be a casualty.